Hi all, welcome to this channel. This is a video of Key West, Florida. Shortly here I'll be taking you to Mallory Square and uh, getting the sunset and live music there. And, and then after sunset we'll be walking on, on Duval Street towards Truman oh, Little White House. Before that we got a cup of coffee and uh, checked out some of the points of interest. Such as a 90 mile mark to Cuba. which is the southernmost point of the U.S. I should say continental U.S. During day two, we'll walk the Edward B. Knight Pier and get the sunset Southernmost boardwalk here. In the Key West. And it's a marina. So without further ado, here are some live uh, performances at Mallory Square. And make sure you stick till the end of the video where we'll talk about pros and cons of staying overnight in Key West. show wasn't that amazing but stay tuned for the live music during sunset. It's a good job of gathering everybody's attention. <laughs> We visited Truman Street and came back for uh, the sunset at Mallory Square just uh, near the end of the night. Is that a church? Yeah. 
on your crystal water. You're shining. Let's go. Hope you guys enjoyed that. Now we're going to all the party. Truman's Little White House. Right. Harry Truman Little White House. Hope you guys enjoyed that. We actually didn't stay in uh, Key West. We stayed in She went to hook me and she spilled her purse. And we laughed until we cried. Now, a lot of you guys, uh, if you've booked a stay in Key West, Florida, you're wondering whether or not you should stay there overnight. Keep in mind that if you do end up staying in Key West, you may miss out exploring all the other keys uh, that are in Florida. The vibe in each key is really different. Key Largo, El Emirata, Marathon, and then finally Key West. There are a lot of other keys uh, along the way, such as Death Key, Fat Deer Key, and Key Colony Beach also had a really favorite park that we enjoyed, Sunset oh, Park. Oh, the chicken has crossed the street. <laughs> the other thing is that for those of you who like driving, there's a seven mile bridge which uh, has just uh, water on both sides of the of the bridge itself and it's a really gorgeous drive if you guys like driving key west uh, must do. key west does end up getting a lot more of the noise and the, and the foot traffic uh, and by noise i mean the uh, uh, roosters and the chickens uh, will make you get up early, bright and early, so watch out for that uh, if you guys are late risers. Well, there you have some insight on where you should stay uh, during your Key West visit. Hope you enjoyed this video and enjoy the rest of the uh, remaining video uh, footage of the sunset. Don't forget to subscribe and especially if you want to hear more about what things you could do in Illa Mirada, uh, Marathon or Key Largo, please leave a comment below. Thanks. Oh yeah, there it is. Such clear water. Yeah, are they eating any fish? They try. They have to try a few times. <laughs>